let's dive into the newest features of CLO 2025.2. First, we've expanded our knitwear design functionality within CLO with our Knit Swatch Editor. Select your knitwear fabric and click the yarn icon next to stitching. Here, you'll be able to design knit swatches with precision. Adjust your gauge size and yarn thickness and apply different stitch types. Then, simulate and apply it to the garment. Visualize different knit styles in seconds. We've added more categories to our pattern drafter. Now, you can easily draft both trousers and skirts. For trousers, we have two options, elastic waistband and slacks. You can create your pattern by entering simple measurements as shown here. Or you can switch to general measurements, which allows you to input more details for increased control and precision. You can also draft trousers and skirts with our AI pattern drafter tool. For skirts, select between basic and flare options. Enter a text prompt, generate an image, and use that image to generate your pattern. Or you can also upload any image and generate a pattern from that. Now you can check the fit and edit garments even faster and more accurately than ever with soft body using GPU simulation. Simply switch to GPU simulation, turn on soft body, and watch how the fit changes. We've updated our notches to be more precise for graded sizes. Now, when you turn on grading, you can see all of your notches across all of your graded sizes at once, and you can control the placement of the notches for each size. You can now make seamless repeats easier than ever. The new update to our texture editor lets you quickly and easily flip images horizontally, vertically, or even both. Our update to graphic measurements in the property editor allows you to move graphics by entering the exact position values. Place your graphics exactly where you want them. Now you can effortlessly duplicate zippers to symmetric patterns simply by right-clicking the zipper and selecting that option. Deactivating linked patterns also applies to zippers. We heard that many of you want to be able to dock your library, so now you can. Click this arrow to move your library back to where it originally was. With this update, the old library will no longer be available in Clo. Now you can easily design with MetaHumans in CLO. Import different bodies and heads in DNA file format for seamless integration with Unreal Engine and other platforms. Once you're done designing in CLO, you can export everything back to the MetaHuman creator. Your garment will automatically resize to any changes you make to the MetaHuman's body, making it easier than ever to create high quality, realistic renders with MetaHumans. We're excited to announce that we've expanded the accessory registration feature to include hats in this release. Simply select your patterns or OPJs and register them as a hat. Once registered, you can add your hat to any of your projects. We also know how much you value avatar customization within Clo. So we've expanded that to kid avatars. Change the avatar's hair, eyes, eyebrows, underwear, skin, and more, all within Clo. We've added a few new user-friendly tools within animation, along with more keyframe options. Now, all layers can be easily added with the click of a button. We've also added the options for solidify, pattern shrinkage, and pressure. 
And we've made it easy to add these keyframes by allowing you to add multiple keyframes at once. Using the option to apply keyframes to all layers or selected layers. Thank you guys so much for watching. We can't wait to see what you come up with using Clo 2025.2. Have fun creating in Clo.